Copyright 666, huh? I'm pretty sure that's expired by now. Hello everybody, I'm Garilla64 and welcome back to Sonic Generations mods. I know they're very few and far between, but you know, people don't make a whole lot of them anymore. I mean, there is a new one that I wanted to check out that isn't this, because this isn't new, this is a couple years old, but I've never made a video about it. And it's the Halloween times, so, uh, I guess we're gonna be rolling with it since I did a Forces one last year, and this one's by far a lot better. But anyway, uh, I guess our idle stance there, Sonic looks like he really hurt his back, maybe trying to move a grill or something. I can relate. You are too slow. Sonic, you keep terrible company around here. You'd think you would find some people that'd be like, Hey, Sonic, you're such a cool and fun and, you know, charismatic and lovable gentleman. But instead, it's just like people who demean you. That's great. What do you have to say, my friend? It's no you. Oh, he said it. He said the line. Uh, okay, so we've got Silver.exe, Shadow.exe. He's like, he heard a joke and he didn't even want to tell us what it was about. What a terrible friend. Whoa. Yo, Sonic's got like the deepest voice I've ever heard. It's like he's gone through puberty seven times. Okay, so I guess we we're going to be checking out... Wow, that really, that looks really nice. I really like the fire junk. Nice. Unfortunately, it is just Green Hill, which means... Uh, you know, it's going to be over in, like, less than two minutes, but... I mean, that means we can play it more than once and look at the beauty. And the motobugs were trashing without even paying attention to them. So he outstretches his hand there when he's, uh, when he's boosting, kind of like... I guess that's, like, what he does in the, uh, in the games and stuff. I am a... <laughs> wow, alright. Very full of yourself, are you? I mean, he, he just kind of believes that, doesn't he? But, like, who, who really cares? God, I haven't played Generations in so long. I want to do another full playthrough, but I don't know if I can justify a stream right now. Maybe at some point. And you know what? Th this only has one level and then the two rival fights, I guess? Because, uh, I don't know, The this is Chapter 1 in air quotes, whatever that means. And, uh, then nothing else was ever released for this, I don't believe. Or not that I could find. I mean, I assume that's probably because the people lost interest because, I don't know, dead meme? De dead creepypasta? Whatever you want to call it. There we go. Doesn't mean Generations isn't fun, though, because it is. Like, gosh darn. So much fun the game is. Why is the ocean, like, yellow? What is that? Is it bone marrow instead of... Bone marrow is probably not yellow, right? I don't want to go for the other thing. The other thing I said in the last Sonic.exe video was like, oh, okay. The urine ocean? That's fantastic. Oh, I said it again. There we go. Let's take a look. Oh, so atmospheric. Look at all that. And we can get a closer look at Sonic's kind of just idle run. Idle run. It's when he runs when he's not doing anything. Technically, that's what he's doing. He's just hovering. And then, if he goes super fast, that's when he outstretches his hand. And he's like reaching for, like his friend is gonna hand him a, a bottle of coke. It says, uh, share a coke with Sonic.exe. And they're like, whoa, what are the odds of that? And he's like, here, you gotta, you gotta share it, it's the rule. Also, what was that on the ground? Oh! That's not a gold ring. <laughs> yeah, I laughed too. Hey, S rank. Two minutes, that's pitiful. But we did stop, so that makes sense. Let's, let's go again and see if we can see anything we didn't see last time. Because, I mean, the stage is not long. So I might as well check it out again and try to show you. I'm going to put my best foot forward and try to get through this as fast as I can. And now that I've said that, guess what's not going to happen? <laughs> it's not going to be the best I can do, obviously. Because, uh, Murphy's Law and all that fun stuff. Alright, barrel through the motobugs. They're the only ones that look out of place here. Like, this is my domain. Maybe he pulled them in, and he's like, Hey, you guys are gonna clean everything, alright? You're gonna clean the place. But they're like, literally everything smells like blood and sulfur. How do we do that? And he's like, you better adapt. And they did not adapt, so now they're dead. 
Also, blood waterfall. That's disgusting. Make sure your mouth is closed. Ew. Don't want to contract anything from this. Who knows where this blood's from? Or it could just be water with red food coloring in it. Which I'm going to lean more towards that because that seems less disturbing and disgusting. And that big fish is... Does he have solid blue eyes and blood all over his face? Yes. No, wait, he's got the he's got the Sonic dot uh, uh not, no, he's got the the uh Fleetway supersonic eyes. He had the blue spirals. Except Fleetway is uh red spirals. No wait, I didn't want Oh shoot, that was going so well! No darn it. I failed you, I'm sorry. Thought that was gonna be the best I could do, but clearly my best is also my worst. There's <laughs> not a very big margin there. You know what, I'm still happy. It's a lot quicker than last time, but I again I did stop, so. Forgot the random stupid purple rock that was there. I never used to know what that was, but then I, I realized it's like it looks kinda like the rocks, I guess. Either that or it's just a giant lump of hardened purple goo. It's like, well where'd that come from and why is it here? I don't want it to be here. My children are afraid. Bop. Hey, welcome back, buddy. That scream, though, when I was, uh, what was I playing? I turned another game on that I was going to record. It was another, like, spooky Sonic.exe thing. And it had a scream in it so loud that I actually decided to not play it. Because it, like... Like, it was a jump scare, obviously. But, like, I, I just kind of, like, the game wasn't good. And I was just like, this this sucks. The entire package just sucks. So, and I was like, that was the icing on the cake, I mean. That's what was like, alright, calling it. 8.13 p.m. It's over. Alright, come on. I'm not infinite loading here, am I? Is that is that what's happening right now, Omocho? Is this the real terror of Sonic.exe? Infinite loading screens? Gotta love Sonic Generations mods sometimes. And aside from infinite loading screens, you also have to love how Generations PC runs in full screen mode only. So... Whenever you start the game up, if, if you click out of the window, because I have the two monitors, uh, the game basically has to, like, it has to minimize itself, which causes both screens to go black, and takes a couple seconds for everything to set up again. Then I'm back on my desktop to click away one window so I can see the game. And then I have to go back through that to get back into the game, and it's just like, wow, I, I wonder why, you know, they didn't add a windowed mode to this. Like, Sonic Heroes PC had windowed mode. And that was a, a while before this. I'm not quite sure what the deal with that is. But, you know, whatever. Whatever floats your boat. I just nailed Shadow.exe. Dot .exe. I like that boost trail he's got. Mighty spooky. It's blood red. Alright, come on, get out of the way. You literally mean nothing. Also, I just noticed the little... Sonic.exe artwork in the bottom left corner. What a silly boy. He's smiling. He's happy. All right, come on. I'll uh, I'll deal with this pretty quickly. This fight's never really been too much of an issue, to be honest. When I first played it, I kind of thought it was hard, but it was just more like because Shadow kept sniping the ball away from me, and of course that was back when I didn't really have any experience with the game, so it's like, oh, now that you actually know how to play the game, it's like, this this fight is not hard. And that's 109. How do you feel about that, Shadow? <laughs> there you go. Oh, see, that actually looked kind of realistic, because when he stopped, his entire body lurched forward a bit. Yeah, that's an S rank. Let's just, let's not beat around the bush there. <laughs> and I saw something in the YouTube page about Silver not being able to be fought. But I mean, he's right here and... The rival battle starts, so I assume Silver's fine, unless he doesn't have... Nope, he's looking, he's looking pretty complete to me. Maybe there was an update at some point. Yeah, okay. Oh, look at... You know how some people have who have beards, they like, they have like, <laughs> they eat soup and their beard gets all covered in, in soup? That's what Silver's chest for, is all covered in blood. <laughs> you goober. Next time you drink blood, put a bib on. Come on. 
You gotta think of the, uh, the rabid fan base, my guy. You can't be all, like, can't be all, uh, disheveled like that. Or perhaps it's the edgy hot topics that you're, uh, you're appealing to with the blood. That, that makes sense. Never mind, you know what, Silver? You probably know better than I do. Look at how happy he looks. Now, be in pain. I like it when you're in pain. You're not my favorite. You're just a hollow shell. With, like... I think you have his voice clips, but I wasn't really paying attention. Whoop! Whoop! Ugh. No, those were definitely not Silver's voice clips. Oh, come on, man. Live a little. Let me homing attack you a few times more. Oh, does that say... Also, up there in the corner, does that say 85 lives? Because that's a... That's a hefty helping of lives they've given me. Wasn't quite aware that I had that many, but you know what? That's pretty cool. Oh, good. Here we go. Nope. Nah. uh <laughs> God, I love Sonic Generation so much. It's such a good game. What is that voice, though? He sounds like a deranged maniac. As opposed to me, who is a totally sane individual in this, in this moment in time. His voice goes from really high-pitched and, and creepy to, like, really deep. What is, what is that about? Does he have, like, is he like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde as one person? Oh, hi. Did he just say go boom? Did he say go boom? I think he said go boom. <laughs> Silver confirmed, five years old. Wait. Wait, give me another chance. I feel like I was- I was cheated. What was that? You like- I'd be really embarrassed if I die to this. I have no boost left, Silver. I had rings, though. I didn't- know. Oh, dear. Um, Silver- I'm very- Oh, jeez. This has literally never happened to me before. I, I didn't know it could go on this long. That's a fitting end, I think. Let's let you want to leave it at that. Let's leave it at that. So anyway, that's gonna be all for Sonic.exe Chapter One Generations today. Uh, cool mod. I mean, it's it's not it's a Sonic.exe mod, but it's like I feel like there was a lot of work put into it, which I can respect. I mean, anytime someone puts effort into something, it's always cool. So anyway, that's gonna be all for today. So if you. If you like this video, okay, maybe I'm choking on my own words, I'm not really sure. If you like this video and you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe, click the bell, follow my Twitter, and join the Discord to keep up with more Sonic Generations mods and other things that aren't Sonic Generations mods, because we hardly do these. I'd also like to give a big ol' thank you to my current sponsors, who are Mitron, Silva PhD, Stefan R3, Emeralds, God's Right Hand, Game Masters, Drawbits, Kenneth Gutierrez, TJ McNee, Knuckles Channel 3, and Knuckles. Atlas Requiem, Random Indolent, Henry S, Rob Morrison, Mega Traffic Cone, Creative, and Mike TGC. Thank you guys so much for sponsoring. It really means a lot. And if you have any interest in becoming a sponsor yourself, please make sure to check out the link in the description for more information and all the benefits, such as being shouted out at the end of every single video and stream. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time with more spoopy video. Oh boy.